here are a few ways that you can navigate the page as you work on your art. I already showed you some of the shortcuts for zooming in. X that we, we made as our zoom in and Z for zooming out. But in addition to that, you can also use, there is a tool up here, the magnifying glass or zoom tool, and it has the same options, zoom in and zoom out. I have a tendency never to use this tool because of the shortcuts that we already have, so it's kind of useless to me, but it is there if you want it. Same with the hand tool I never use because I have the space bar that I just use, but the rotate is also under the move. Um, so every tool may have sub tools underneath it, and some will have a lot of sub tools. And the move tool has this rotate sub tool that lets us rotate the canvas. And this could be helpful if we need to work at an angle. It's, sometimes when we're drawing, it just isn't helpful to draw straight up and down. We need to turn things around or over or whatever. So we can do this. And uh, when we're done, if we want to get back to zero, to like the main orientation, we can use this thing down here, which also lets us um, do the exact same thing to rotate. And if we want to restore it, we just click the button that resets the rotation to our initial orientation. So you can also have it use these buttons to have it go in kind of standardized jumps. Um, I use these sometimes more than, I, I tend to never use the move tools at all. So, I mean, you have this right here. What's the point of changing tools? Same with the zoom. There's also a zoom slider right here. So we can zoom in and out and Same, there's another option, we have the buttons. So there's all kinds of ways to move your canvas, but just remember that Control Z will restore it. But when it's not in the, the proper orientation, it won't, it, it's gonna stay at that angle. So to get it back, you just press this button. You also have the navigator um, window up here, which is this, I'm gonna make it a little larger. So if you hover on the bottom edge, see right here we can drag it down make it a little larger but basically this lets us kind of slide around the canvas we can zoom in and drag it around if we want this also has a, a plus or minus so we can get it as close as we want and drag it to wherever we want so these are just different options for uh, moving around the page there's like so many options for zooming in and out. It's, it's almost overwhelming. I also have a way to fit it to the navigator screen and fit it to, what's the other option? Fit to screen. Yeah, so these are very similar though. Uh, it just depends on where you're at in your orientation and how you have this window sized. But yeah, those are different ways that you can move in and out. There's also one other option if you want. The, on your mouse, if you have a track wheel on your mouse, the, the button in the middle that is like a circle, you can use that to zoom in and out. So there's a plethora of options for zooming in and out.